Here's all the brand new comic book series debuting for the week of April 29th, 2015, including Enormous. This is the trade paperback. It uh, gives us the entire uh, first uh, ongoing series of six issues from Tim Daniel at 215 Inc. Looks great. This could have a small print run and sell out, being a small publisher. And Afterburn gives us Sky Storm Origins, number one. Alterna Comics gives us Fubar, Mother Russia, number one. It's a really big week for small print indies, including Steambusters, which is sort of a steampunk version of Ghostbusters. This book is sold out in advance of release. This could be a hot book this week. We've also got Steampunk Sherlock Holmes, Steam Detective Case Files, Beauty and Bohemian from Antarctic Press. Black Mask always gives us high quality product, including Mayday number one. Boom Studios brings back the Steven Universe TV show in a new special. The Order of the Forge is a new miniseries over at Dark Horse. And look at this. This could potentially be the biggest comic of the year. It's going to be interesting to see what happens this week. It is believed that possibly Bruce Wayne and the Joker both die in this issue. This book is sold out in advance of release in all versions. The combo pack edition of this is already pre-selling for over $100. This book is going to be super hot. Carpe Noctum is a new series that looks really good from Hashtag Comics. This is a new monthly ongoing series. I recommend this one. Gem and the Holograms has proven to be very popular. Number one had seven covers, and they've all sold out. And even the number twos are starting to sell out in advance of release. Check this one out based on the popular 80s series. And speaking of 80s, we've got Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. This is another one of the biggest books of the year. This is the third printing of number 44. People still wondering if Donatello has really died or not. We should find out in number 45. The first printing is also out this week, so this will be a popular one. And The Walking Dead is back with volume 23 of the trade paperback, and this collects the uh, last six months worth of issues. Just to give you an idea how big this book is, uh, the print run is over 200,000 extra copies sitting in the Diamond Warehouse for future sales. Over at Marvel, they're back with Darth Vader at number three. This is the second printing, cool cover. This is the first appearance of Afra. And there's also, uh, over at Marvel, they've got all the last issues of the Marvel Universe titles ending this week before Secret Wars debuts next week. Northwest Press, number one, sold out really fast for Rise Comics Against Bullying, number one. And here is number two with a star-studded lineup working on this book, very small print run. Titan Comics gives us high-quality comics. They bring us Doctor Who, and now they bring us Scarlet Couture. And this one's got a couple of different covers, sexy female detective and grim fairy tales oz reign of witch queen is a new mini series from xenoscope with of course a bunch of cool variant covers so lots of great books out this week you can order any of these at our website hawknesscomics.com check out my weekly market reports on books selling out print runs books heating up in value our weekly market uh, videos and the best selling back issues etc order any of these books any other products coming out from our website and of course, check out our market reports also at comicsheatingup.net. Thanks for watching.